So here I've got some data which is a uh, customer rating data. So there is data related to uh, the ratings provided by the customers. And what we want to do now is to analyze uh, why the ratings might be low uh, and what would might be the reasons affecting those. So there is one nice chart that is provided by Power BI. It is known as the key influencers chart. So I'm just, it's right over here next to the Python um, uh, visual. And if you just click on it, it will get added to your designer canvas. So this is what it looks like. And now I'm going to add some fields to this chart. If you see in the fields, well, you'll see that it has got uh, values like the analyze, explain by and expand by. So analyze is basically what is the parameter that you want to analyze and then explain by is what are the factors based on which you want to uh, analyze that measure or that uh, value that you have added. So analyze is going to be, let's say in the customer table, we have something called the rating. So a customer provides a rating for the services. So we are going to analyze the ratings provided by the customer. So we're going to add it to the analyze option. All right. And then it is asking us that what exactly do we want to analyze this by? So we can analyze it by different factors. Um, maybe I can analyze it by the country. Okay, and you can add multiple factors in the country in the uh, explain by maybe I want to analyze it by the role in the organization as well. And what else do I want to analyze it by? Let's see. Uh, subscription. Okay. So these are the two things that we have already added. We can add multiple factors in the explain by area for this. So let's do something from subscription as well. So this is subscription ID. This is going to be a subscription type. So what kind of subscription does the customer have that might be affecting um device let's leave it for now company company size might be affecting so okay so now i have chosen a group of factors based on which i want to analyze why my rating is either uh, high or low so again let's go over here and increase the text sizes to make it more easy for us to view okay so these are the only ones we have available. So let's try to increase this. Okay. So now if you see closely, you'll be able to see uh, a few things that are appearing in this key influencers uh, chart or report. Uh, so this is your key influencers and there is one other uh, uh, tab that is known as top segments. So you have two tabs. This is giving you the key influencers. What influences rating to be high? We can choose it to be low because we want to analyze why it is low. So let's choose it uh, low. And every time you make a change in the selection, it gives you a message that it's running some analysis in the back end and now it has analyzed the data. So it is simply saying that when the likelihood of rating being low increases by the role in organization is consumer that it increases by 2.57 X. So 2.57 times it increases when your subscription type is premier, your rating might, your chance of having a rating of low increases by this company size is less than 5,000 country region as France, all these analysis it is going to perform and give you the <clears throat> results right over here. And then there is a nice chart over here that gives you role in organization percent of rating is low for these many counts of customers. Uh, if your role is administrator, it is this thing. If I change it to subscription type, it will give me a bar chart for the subscription type, different subscription types and when the what is the count of rating as low. So you can analyze these different parameters that we just added to it. If you click on top segments, OK, it just gives you it. Uh, creates these uh, segments which are like a combination of characteristics or combination of those parameters that you define and it calculates that for this segment um, the percent 
percentage of rating that is given as low is 32.6 percent so obviously segment one is something that is of most concern because that is giving us the lowest the highest percentage of low ratings if you click on the segment one you will see what is the combination of characteristics that it has considered so it has considered company size less than 5000 country region france role in organization is not publisher its subscription type is premier it gives you all these analysis results in, in terms of different charts uh, you can also click on learn more about this segment so no further insights were found so if there were any insights you can have your insights you can click on the next segment right from here and it will give you what are the segments here what is the permutation combination of values it has taken for those parameters and what are the analysis results so this is a nice way of of analyzing your data again in terms of um, analyzing the performance um, um, so this is one of the examples like you are analyzing the customer ratings there might be cases when you want to analyze your number of defects so what are the factors influencing the number of defects happening in your process so you can analyze a number of factors your factors have to be added right over here if you go to the visualizations pane once again you will see whatever you want to analyze so for example now you want to analyze the total number of defects in the process you have to add that to the analyze bucket and whatever factors you want to evaluate it against you have to add it to the explain by so again a nice little chart very informative and all the analysis being done in the back end by power bi using the intelligence of the power bi 